loves you and is healing you. Hey, come here, this is mama behind here. <sighs> Listen, this is a disease that was in your mom. Yes, yes, eh? yes. And you are aware. Yes, okay. Eh? Thank you. Okay, yeah? Yes, he's sick. So now it's coming to you. Thank you, Jesus. Because you, you always feel heavy here. Yes. Eh? Yes. And then now your mom have the same disease yes. that affects the side. So you, as I'm praying for you, I'm praying for your mom. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. These people who say mama will die without seeing any good thing. Because every time he said, eh? I want God to take me where the people is. is mama will said, die. Thank you, Let her live and see the fruits from her children. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I greet you all in the wonderful name of our Lord Jesus Christ. The viewers all over the world, welcome to Charis Missionary Church. This is our Sunday life service under the leadership of Apostle JB and Prophetess T. E. Makanenisa. And with me here today is my mother, who was located during the service by the Apostle who ministered upon her life. Ma, kindly please tell us your name and tell us where you come from. My name is Ruthie Saint. I'm coming from Malawi, but I'm staying here in South Africa. Today during the service, the Apostle located you and he ministered upon your life. I'd love that you please tell us what he said and please confirm it. Okay. Uh, today I received my prophecy because prophet he, he just talked about my mother. He said my mother is sick. I said yes, he's sick because now it's like uh, oh, 20 years he's sick. So sometimes my mother just phoned me said ah, I, it's better God to take me like to die. I tell my mother said ah, no, don't don't talk like this because every time I pray for you. So like. The, the day I start coming here, there's a prophet from Malawi. He just sent the a message for me. He said, go to uh, Tembisa, because the, the time he didn't know the, the is shifting this site. And then I just uh, followed the, the message to come here. And uh, that time I come here, I just like I'm happy. I just happy that time because I know the problem is solved. Mm -hmm. uh, the time I just step this place, I know one day prophet he prophesy about my mother, and today is the day prophet he prophesy about my mother, and I'm happy. So, Ma, how has the issue of your mother being sick been affecting you? Yeah, it's affecting me, even the whole family, because everyone is just thinking about my mother. Because it just take my mother like a hospital and a, like a, um, like Sangomas to to take my mother. It's like a, or it's just heal the side, but it, no, uh, no avail. And I tell my my sisters and brothers in Malawi ne? And, and said stop to take my mother to Sangoma because now it's time to play for my mother because every time I had a dream even I, I dream mama and I tell mama I said mama I want prophet to play for me and mama said just talk to prophet everything you said he pray for you and that time and he, he just asking me said what do you want and I said, I want to support my mother only. No. I didn't say my mother is sick. I just said, I want to support my mother. And Prophet, he, pro he just prayed for me. And today, yeah, is my day. I'm happy. And Ma, how do you feel that today the man of God located you and he ministered upon your life? The time Prophet to prophesy about my life, even the mother's life, I, I believe even my family now he received my my deliverance because it's a it's a family like there's no one to stand in marriage ne? because every time I pray about this also about my, my children thinking about there's no one to stand in marriage every time they, if I'm said there's no one there's no one because everyone you get two marriage three marriage but no no like ave you see so i just pray for god god please locate my family 
because this issue is affecting me. Because I know even my children, it just affect like this because it's a certain. Yes, so today I'm, I'm happy and I'm happy. Thank you, Jesus.